there is a difference between being dangerous and being desperate. And this is hard for people to understand in a world of Nike commercials and Gatorade commercials, convincing people that forcing and working harder is the answer to success. Because when we look at these high performing individuals that everyone admires and we peel back the layers, there is a difference. These individuals are dangerous. And I'll give you an example. On the starting line, 400 meter race, you've got person one that is so prepared to run out of their shoes, excited to run out of their shoes. In fact, they might not even know if they can win. In that moment, they might not even believe that they're the best on the line, but they're there to embrace every second of that race. And they're gonna stop at nothing. First place, seventh place, doesn't matter. They're all in. All in meaning they've recognized that failure is a possibility, but they're not attached to it. Person two, on the starting line, thinking, I need to win this. I have to win this to be okay. I have to do well to be okay. One individual's all in, the other individual's in if things are going well. You tell me who you would want to be in that situation. Now you may be thinking, okay, that's great. Of course I wanna be person one. How do I get there? And I'm actually gonna take some wisdom from Kobe Bryant and he says, you've gotta get over yourself. It's not about you. And I think that is so important because we reduce down the whole life experience we have to winning this one individual game, event, race. And yes, you can take this even further to Olympics. We reduce down the whole life experience to this one specific outcome. And as Kobe Bryant would say, people don't care that much. You've got to get over yourself. Same thing with these competitions, challenges we step into. We need to get over ourselves. That is where freedom lies, where we can stand on that starting line. We can, we can come up to that face-off dot. We can stand at the blue line and, and be free as we skate up to take that penalty shot. So as you step up to your starting line, you have the option. You can do this through desperation and you can tell yourself you need this win to be okay. Or you can say, you know what? I don't even know if I can do this. I don't know if I'm the best person here, but you know what? Let's go find out. It's not about me. It's about the adventure in front of me. You're going to have to step onto the track anyways and get this thing done. So why don't we take a step back and say, you know what, I'm, I'm sick of being exhausted before the race has even started. I'm, I'm sick of thinking I need this to be okay. Just saying this isn't about me. This is about the adventure I am lucky enough to have right now. And I'm gonna do it with joy in my heart. I'm gonna embrace the heck out of this. I'm gonna make sure I have a ton of fun because when I'm having fun, I perform better. And we all know that to be the case. So in conclusion, if we can get over ourselves, we unlock the ability to be free and to embrace every step of the race and put every bit of our heart and soul into each step. So you decide, am I gonna do this through desperation or am I gonna go out there and be free and incredibly dangerous? As always, thanks for listening. Leave any comments below.